Demi Lovato will be performing sooner than we expected. It was just announced that the artist will have the honor of singing the national anthem at this year's Super Bowl. And what is so weird about all of this is Demi essentially low-key manifested this 10 years ago. Can you believe that? Well, we have all the details. I'm Gabby Conti. I'm Tony Morris. And this is Hot on Hollywire. It was recently announced that the multi-platinum singer-songwriter will sing the national anthem to kick off the 54th Super Bowl between the San Francisco 49ers and Kansas City Chiefs at the Hard Rock Stadium in Miami on Sunday, February 2nd. What's truly wild about this is in 2010, the singer tweeted one day, I'm going to sing the national anthem at a Super Bowl one day. Well, it seemed like that one day came. It came. It's, it's here. here. It's, it's coming. here. It's, it's coming. It's sometime. It's in, in less than a month, her dreams will come true. It's so true. If you want something, you just got to put it out there into the universe or on Twitter. Lovato's Super Bowl performance will actually be her second live performance since her overdose. The last time we heard the singer's four octave soprano pipes live was in her Tell Me You Love Me world tour in Brazil on November 27, 2018. So it has been over a year since she's performed live. Four octave soprano pipes? Yeah, that's how high her voice can go. Where did you find this information? On the internet. It said that she's four. She has Four octaves, it's true. If you can hear how like octaves are just the different levels, and so soprano is the high, she can hit four different types of soprano notes. You guys are learning so much, it's crazy. It was also recently announced that the Grammy-nominated singer, songwriter, actress, advocate, philanthropist, and businesswoman. She wears so many hats. Gosh, hats. darn Sorry, it. This you is could just awesome. say one of She'll be performing at the 2020s Grammys on January 26th. This makes her one of 19 artists to perform at the award show, which also includes Taylor Swift, Ariana Grande, and our loved ones, the Jonas. I mean, I don't know about you. I'm I'm watching the Super Bowl. I'm watching the Grammy. Are you big. watching the Super Bowl because of the Chiefs and the 49ers, or are you watching because of Demi Lovato? Tony, no, I watch the Super Bowl for three things. Okay, let's get it. The who sings the national anthem. Got it. The commercials. Got it. And then the halftime show. And I then I'm that. done. I hosted a Super Bowl party once, and I called it the Lady Gaga viewing party when Lady Gaga did the halftime show because that's all me and my friends cared about, and everyone cleared out after the halftime show. Well, so the singer announced her Grammy performance on Instagram last week with a picture of her and the text Grammy performer and the caption, I told you the next time you'd hear from me, I would be singing <sighs> and fans, they lost their mind. Lost In just it. 25 minutes, this post gained 153,000 likes. People were all about this. That's going to be a good one. The Grammy performance? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. you know what? I, she can belt. That girl can like, she... Four octave soprano. Four octaves. Is that That's what the belt what it is? is? That's I didn't the know what belting. the belt yeah. But that wasn't enough. The very next day, Demi Lovato announced on IG that she will be singing the national anthem at the Super Bowl. We're not even done with January, and 2020 is already looking like the most epic time of all time for the singer. It really is. Like she's already crushing it. Like, like talk about a comeback, okay? Singing the national anthem at the Super Bowl is a very incredibly prestigious privilege. Lovato will be joining the iconic lineup of Super Bowl national anthem performers, which includes Lady Gaga, Beyonce, Whitney Houston, Jennifer Hudson, Alicia Keys, and Mariah Carey. Janet Jackson? Janet Jackson. Well, that was halftime, but did she also sing that? That was halftime. But, 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 but I will say some of those people that I just said that have done the national anthem have gone on to do the halftime show. So curious, is it national anthem today? Is she going to be doing the halftime show tomorrow? Not this year, because this year, Jennifer Lopez and Shakira, they're headlining C's <laughs> Super Bowl halftime show. So if that's not enough for you Lovotics, uh, the two-time Grammy nominee, who's obviously in full comeback mode, also announced she'll be releasing her most vulnerable album yet after the Grammy gig. The album will touch on her overdose, time in rehab, sobriety, and her struggle and journey to get sober. Finally, they've been wanting this. Been the logistics of her tour to go with the album haven't been finalized yet, but it's something that we probably could be expecting within the next year. So what do you guys think of Demi Lovato's comeback? Will you be watching her sing the national anthem at this year's Super Bowl? Let us know. I'm Gabby Conti. I'm Tony Morris. And follow us on Hollywire for your celebrity connection.